Recently, there has been a big increase in dirt bikes being stolen, and it's all happening across the capital region. Kumi Tucker spoke to a racer and has surveillance video in a story that you're seeing only on 13. This is video of at least two people breaking into a backyard shed in a quiet East Greenbush neighborhood. They stole Scott Jubik's three dirt bikes. One was brand new. He says together they're worth about $22,000. He didn't want his face shown. But now they took a peace of mind from me, you know. It's not only they take the bikes, they took a peace of mind, and that's what's really, you know, frightening. And um, I don't know, I just, I wish something more could be done you know, around here because it's happening all the time, it seems like, you know, I know a bunch of people it's happened to. It's well known in the racing community that it's happening all over the capital region. At least five other racers told us it's happened to them. I'm no professional. I race amateur, you know, but, um, you know, I plan on my son racing in the future. You know, he's one years old. That's another scary thing. You know, I got a kid now and, you know, people, you know, on my property, snooping around and stealing from me and police are investigating and confirm that dirt bikes are being stolen a lot in this case the criminals used what looks like a u-haul van and those u-hauls are also being stolen the racing community has been taken a big hit by you know people stealing their bikes and even even people that just use their bikes recreational you know trail riding and stuff and it's you know it seems to be a big targeted situation lately Scott was selling bikes, but he's not sure if that's what led criminals to him. Anyone with information is asked to contact East Greenbush Police. The East Greenbush Police Department, for example, is a designated safe space. And police say if you're posting stuff to sell, it's best to meet or show merchandise at a place like this. Don't do it at your home. In East Greenbush, Kumi Tucker, News Channel 13.